I'm Patrick Lancaster, and right now we are in the center of Donetsk. And once again, Ukrainian forces have opened fire with rockets on the center of Donetsk, hitting many civilian uh, areas. And we can even hear more in the distance coming. Um, but uh, this uh, church, the Holy Transfiguration Cathedral in the center of Donetsk, was also hit for a second time. Um, and is this a military target? Should Ukraine be firing on this church or this whole neighborhood here where there's just businesses, shops? Many businesses have been hit today. Many uh, civilian homes and uh, apartments have been hit. Uh, can you answer? Can you can you tell the the uh, government officials what Ukraine is doing here? Something needs to happen to stop this uh, attacks on uh, civilians in the center of Donetsk and anywhere in the world. Civilians coming under attack is not right. But we're here in Donetsk to show you what's happening here to show you the senseless random attacks on civilians by Ukrainian forces in the center of Donetsk. Please like, subscribe, and share. Now let's go in and have a look to see what the situation is in the church. Oh. One thing I didn't mention, that kind of hits me uh, close to the heart because this is where my oldest son was baptized. It's a real shame. We can see the debris that's just fallen down here from the top of the church. Uh, we've actually got two impacts, one at the top and one here. Uh, so we're gonna maybe try to go inside and take a look. Now we can see here the uh, casing or the, the motor, you could say, of the grad rocket itself. And we can see the hole in the side of the dome here in the, the church. It seems no one was injured here, but it's uh, said purportedly that there's been at least seven injured in Donetsk in this attack this morning. Uh, we can thank God that the majority of the church wasn't destroyed. It's just the one hole in the roof and then another impact outside as we saw. <sighs> So we'll have a little bit of a look around here again, uh, in here, and then hit, uh, bad word I guess to use, but go to another uh, location uh, where there was these attacks this morning by Ukrainian forces on the civilian population of Donetsk. Oh. Что ты сказал? Муниципальное образовательное учреждение, школа номер два имени Героя Советского Союза. Все школы, да? Для детей, да? Ага. Сколько лет детей будет здесь, когда мы работаем дома? После девятого класса лет четырнадцать. Ага. Слава Богу, мне работа, да? Фигню кто-нибудь будет убирать или что-нибудь? Да, я не знаю. Можно сказать, что произошло? Э, ну как что? Прилетело в 7 утра. Да? Да. И, и, и как вы думали, почему? Можно э, э, войны объект здесь? Это войны нет, объект? Нет, это школа. Ага. Это церковь, это администрация. Ага. Все вокруг побили. Ага. Администрация тоже попал? Ну вон она куча, видите, на той стороне. Такая же воронка. А, библиотека, да? Ну, кон... ну вот она, вот прямо, видите, прямо сразу. А, ага, понял. Ну там тоже воронка. Здесь по прямое попадание в купол в церкви. Да, мы, мы уже вижу это. И то, то, только один? Один. Один. 
Ну вот мы ждем, потому что там видно остаток или снаряда, или что мы не можем. там, да? Да, да. Вам не видно его? Не, мы только только здесь. Ну вон, сейчас я вам... А, наверное, ребята уже его вытащили. Да, были МЧС и российские были ребята. Они вытащили саперы, минеры, кто тут был, я не знаю. И как вы думали, почему украинский стреляет здесь? На скулу и Куда мы знаем? Они на, по нам стреляют уже девятый год. Ну да, я знаю. Не, может, они подумал, это сколько в бане бегали, как? Как могу? А а тут ты, нет, думал, они спешали? Здесь военных нет нигде. В центре да. города нету их нигде. Думал, если, если мы их, по крайней мере, не видим и не знаем. Ага. Это уже каждый день, да? Каждый день, да. Вот сегодня в 7 утра на работе было уже два человека. Вот это мы все это слушали, слышали и видели. И они опять, да? Опять. Это Киевский район. И знаю, тут или церковь, или там ранено, или нет? Нет, нет. Ну, мы целые остались. Вот нас двое было. Там немножко окна у нас повредило, а так... Ну тут буквально ну ну чуть-чуть не долетело, так бы угол снесло. Ага, хорошо. Извините, спасибо. So we don't have to say much here. You heard it from the woman herself, and you see this hole in front of the school. Thank God that the authorities of the Donetsk People's Republic have closed the schools so there was no uh, children that got injured here today. And they were closed because of the war, because I know that Ukraine fires on civilian areas, civilian schools, civilian hospitals uh, uh, every day now. So they did a good job of closing uh, uh, all the schools and saving lives of children. So let's go see another uh, location that was uh, hit. And, uh, and just in case we didn't mention it before, that school was right next to the church. So now we're just across the street from both of those in front of the uh, local administration building. And it appears that there was an impact here that they might have, they've already started to clean up, uh, but we're gonna take a closer look. Well, that is strange. О. Ага. А, алюминий. Да, вроде града. Не думал, что это града. And the library just across here has no windows left. And over here has no windows. So apparently it hit here behind us and knocked out all these windows or maybe there's another impact. Ага, окей, я вижу. Okay, so we see that there was two impacts here. One over there that we saw that made the uh, street come up a bit. And we see all these windows here. And it wasn't necessarily only that one. It seems here there was another rocket that came straight over this building, landed here and exploded, knocked out all those windows, knocked out all these windows. <sighs> and we see the administration here have, doesn't seem to be touched at all. Um, but this is the very, very center. Okay, so we've moved on a little bit and right now we're just across, again, from the, the church itself, from the school that we got, saw the impact, and then over there is the street of the administration that we saw the impact as well. Okay. Now we've got another impact. And this one says a lot, we get a lot of information from this. This impact obviously came from that direction. Now looking at the uh, maps, it seems like that direction is more or less uh, the uh, uh, Edivka Pesky direction of the front line in that direction where Ukraine fires on the center of Donetsk from. And we can see the same thing happened on the side of that church. Uh, it came from that direction as well. So there's a lot more locations that have been hit, so we're gonna move on. And we can see all of the cars that are still going. People are just used to this. 
And this happened just hours ago. You can see the holes just here and across the street. But there's so many people that are still going to work, living their lives. Because they've been living this for nine years almost. All right, now we're just getting right across the street back here to next to the church. Uh, and that's because like these uh, rockets come down, they come down in like a square. And we're going to go across over to this uh, kind of strip mall office store area uh, that took a direct hit. Looks like a lot of the upper floor was completely destroyed. So let's go. All right, and we've moved on to this uh, little strip mall here, which we can see the whole upper floor is gone. And this is all uh, stores and uh, other things, even offices in this building. And uh, we can see almost destroyed now. And if we go a little bit over here, you can see this is like a, a university, a technical university, where they also have uh, housings for uh, students. And you can see some of that was damaged here. And we can go over here. Uh, we can see another impact, and it come, come, come here. You can see here's exactly what the uh, uh, building is, and it's a good thing that the uh, Donetsk People's Republic authorities have thought ahead and closed the universities, closed the schools because of the war, because they know Ukraine is shelling all of the uh, universities. Uh, stores here in the center, even the hospitals. They say every single hospital in the Donetsk People's Republic has damage uh, from Ukrainian shelling. Uh, now here's another uh, impact. We've already filled in some of it here. This couple hours ago uh, was the attack, but we're showing you everything we can. Uh, so now uh, we're gonna uh, head a little uh, farther. We're still on the same line. It was Administration Street, uh, school, um, uh, church. Now we're across the street from a church on this side, another school, uh, a strip mall. And now a little bit farther uh, around the same uh, area, we're told there's a hospital that's been hit. So let's go check that out. Okay, we're just walking behind the office parts of the uh, strip mall area. And uh, we see uh, that there's another impact right over here. So let's go check that out. So here's the uh, impact right behind the strip mall and uh, we see it didn't come from that direction. Um, and up here we see there's uh, trees covering the, the uh, skyline here so it didn't come that direction. But if we look over here, we see there's knock down trees from here and an open clearing uh, here where it appears that the rocket flew from which is basically the exact same direction as over there. We're making our way a little closer to the area we think the hospital's at, and we've already found another uh, impact here on the ground. So we, just us today, have seen over, I guess, what, nine so far, but purportedly there was about 40, a full uh, truck of uh, rockets fired. Uh, but we've seen a lot. I mean, we're definitely not gonna get to them all today, but let's just see if we could find uh, the uh, hospital. See what the damage was. Just. Здравствуйте. Э, где прилет был? Прилет где был? Прилет. Саш. Прилетел где? А, прилет. Там есть. Ага. Что это? Что это здание? Котельное. Котельное. Войны нету здесь, да? Ну вот, вот. Греют дома. Ага. Дом, да? Дома греют, да. Отопление. Ага, ага. Понял. А за вата и тепление. Ага. Ага, не военный объект, да? Нет. Здрасте. Делай натяжку. Вот одна. Ага. Града, да? А, вот, верит это. Да, именно града. Она как раз побила. Мус. 
что да, тут особо и не видно ее. Осколки разлетелись, на нее никто не обращает внимания. А сам основной прилет с той стороны в крышу. Ага. Откуда это стреляет? Откуда? Оттуда? Это как? тоненькая, наверное, из тоненького стреляет. Ага, украинский, да? Конечно. И как вы думали, почему они стреляют здесь? Ну, максимальный урон причинит донецким жителям. Может, Больше... они пытаются войне объект стреляют? Войне объект здесь? Нет, военных объектов. Котельная. Идет отопление на жилые дома. Ага. Да, все-таки пакет, пакет выпустили. Ой, что они будут делать? Не знаю. Здравствуйте. Здравствуйте. Все нормально? Все отлично. Как да. видите. Ага. -а -а. что, что вы сделаете сейчас? Сбор конструкции. Ага. У вас э, кто вы, вы как пожар? Вон старший, вон старший. Ага. Можно, да? Да, конечно. Привет, секунду, во внутрь не заходите, пожалуйста. Хорошо, хорошо. Вау, это не маленький, блин. Это не маленький. Uh, so the fire department is here uh, on this uh, water boiling heating uh, plant. Uh, this is a place that heats the water for the radiators of apartments. Uh, they're getting ready to do some destruction here to make sure the dangerous parts of the building are uh, d taken care of correctly. We're going to try to get in for a second. They say it's dangerous, but we're going to wait on the uh, uh, supervisor and see if we can get in and have a look to see exactly what the damage was. Это, что это лекарство за отопление, да? Это электрика, котел, отопление. Для отопления котельной здесь электричество было. Станция, подстанция. So this is like the electric room of the boiler uh, for uh, heating uh, the water for the radiators of the apartments near here. This is what heats the the water that heats the people that will keep them warm through the winter. We see this has been totally destroyed here and a lot of other uh, shrapnel has gone through the windows and other places. Uh, so now we're going to move on to the next location it has been hit and let the firefighters do their work here to make sure it's safe. This is right? Yes, And we see another impact here uh, at this uh, building, which is part of the hospital. Uh, they call this the student hospital uh, here in center Donetsk. And we can see this is a uh, big impact here on the roof. And again, where we just were at the uh, water heating area, uh, that's about 50 meters in that direction, if not less. And we can see the uh, shrapnel came across and knocked out all the windows here, or at least over half of them, of uh, this uh, 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 a small apartment building, a hostel. It's basically another uh, building that the Donetsk People's Republic authorities gave uh, small apartments to people who have been victims of shelling. Their homes destroyed or they live in dangerous areas. Uh, there's many of these uh, uh, buildings uh, around the center here that the Donetsk People's Republic uh, authorities try to bring and have been doing for eight years, bringing people to safety in a somewhat safe environment. But we see it's already not safe here. Let's see if we can get a little closer into the impact here. All right, so we just came into the uh, downstairs entrance of this uh, part of the hospital, and we're going to try to make our way up to the area that actually got hit. Здравствуйте. Да, тоже. Мы уже поздравили намного. Да, да, да. Уже много места было, я чуть-чуть забил. Да, мы просто не знаем, где еще прилет. У нас больницу тут хорошо на четвертом. На английском только дочь моя может. Я не могу. Вот здесь у нас женщина лежала. Больная. Вот. Голову ранения у нее там зашили, все. Вот все будет нормально? Она будет хорошо? Нормально, оказали первую помощь, да, как бы. И за что она лежит здесь? 
Ну, у нее целый с печенью, у нее с печенью там, с печенью очень а -а -а. тоже проблемы, да. И... И как бы вот здесь ее... So только один ранен был, да? Да, да, да. Одна. А -а -а. У нее ногу и в голову ранение было. Так, а так все. Кровь а -а -а. здесь. Первую помощь оказали, ее зашили. Она во второй палате у нас сейчас ее там перевели. Ага. Вон, ну куда зайдете, там я вижу, в Доктор's office, Пирс. О, maybe a nurse's area to sleep. And, uh huh. Another sleeping area. Luckily, it looks like it wasn't being used. All right, there was reportedly 40 rockets that came down this attack. I don't know how many we've seen, maybe 15, something like this. Uh, but we've shown you as much as we can here. We can't go all over the city showing you every single rocket that hits every single time, several times a day. But we're showing you the facts here on the ground of how Ukraine is firing on civilian areas in the center of Donetsk. I mean, what did we see today to recap? A church that was hit. Uh, two schools, hospital, uh, the, the, uh, the water heating uh, plant for the, uh, the heating of apartments so the people don't freeze to death. This is not right. Um, I'm not on the west side of y Ukraine. I can't show you what's going on there, but I can show you what's going on here. And I'm here because the Western mainstream media won't show you this. Anything that's not positive for Ukraine, they won't show you. They won't show you the atrocities and the war crimes that Ukraine commits on the civilians of Donetsk and a lot of Donbass. But I will, and I'll continue. So please like this video, share it across all social media. Uh, and remember, we're totally independent and crowdfunded journalists We're only able to do this work because we're supported by our viewers like you. So please, support our work with the link on the screen or in the description. There's more to come. We're out.